Because that's just common sense. Because when you don't, he hurts you for this type of mistake. Brown outside. Second shot opportunity. And Pirtle lays it up and in. Five points in the game. There he is, beasting on the glass, converting the opportunity, trying to put this game away. So active. So energetic. Helping to lead the charge. He may not be thought of as big for a center, but with his ability to go vertical, he sure plays big. None passes to Brown. Over Igudawa. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. No other way to put it. Just a poor shooting performance for him. But luckily, his teammates have picked up the slack. Davis kicks to Jones. Back to Davis. Shoots over Langford. Again, Los Angeles. His field goal percentage is creeping up there now. I mean, it wasn't pretty in the first quarter. None passes to Brown. A three ball. Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got rebound number seven for him tonight. It's been a really tough quarter for him. He cannot get his shots to drop. And no doubt they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. San Antonio calls timeout. They come into this one having outplayed the Magic last game. And it says a lot about you that even when you're not at your best, they definitely were still in that game and able to win comfortably. Just looking at the box score, you wouldn't think they did enough to pull it out, but all the intangibles, that's what won in the ball game tonight. Brown outside. Collins passes to Brown. Over James. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. 22 points for lights out. And so it's Iguodala. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. Trailing by 17. Next matchup, they'll be home against the Suns. That game will be a quick pit stop before hitting the road again. Whether he's driving, posting up, firing from deep, you know LeBron has it all. He's been a fantastic evening for him. Brown 
down inside the line. None. And Jones sends it back. Langford dishes to Brown. And he knocks down the jumper. Brown's got 24. 119 left now here in the second. LeBron against Pirtle. James in the post. LeBron Lays it up and banks it in. LeBron's got 15. Oh, he's just super efficient when he's close to the rim. James is like a master at knowing which way to take him. Brown feeling out a bit. Shoots it. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. He's got 26. There's 47 seconds left to play here in the half. Hurdle against James. Inside, here's Forbes. The lead pass was put in just the right spot. And we're seeing some great ball movement out of this group, guys. San Antonio leading by 15. Brown outside. For three. And James pulls it down. Yeah, and, and that three-point shot, it really has looked off here in the second quarter. It hasn't stopped him from attempting them, but it, it's time to maybe find something else to do. Oh, the defender plays tough, but Davis is tougher. Plays through the contact with the Thor. And here is Brown. Oh, oh big time <laughs> shot. He just beat the buzzer. Wow. He barely beat the buzzer right there. Mm. Wow, what a way to finish up the quarter. Well, every once in a while, a prayer like that somehow finds... And so it's the San Antonio Spurs with a sizable lead as the quarter wraps... And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route... Substitution here for the Lakers. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stance for the Spurs. They played a heads-up brand of basketball this entire game. And they've got the steals to prove it. And also, their second chance points have been a story all night as well. That That's just pure effort and hustle. Free throw no good for Armstrong. You know, Chris, I remember back in the day and at one point in the Western Conference, they had you, they had Tim Duncan, they had Kevin Garnett, all Hall of Famers, all so great to win. Yeah, we had some battles. You can't forget about guys like Dirk Nowitzki. We had to play two ways then. If you were a four, you were a five. So David Robinson, Carl Malone, uh, Shaq. <laughs> yeah, that was all in a week's work. So with Johnson on the bench, here's how the floor looks for Greg Popovich. Aldridge out there with Robinson. Then there's Brown. Then it's Kendrick Nunn. And it's Primo in at the shooting guard position. Robinson finds Brown. Puts up a three. And he's good on the three ball. Brown's got 32 points in the game. Strong work for him at the offensive 